So, hello and welcome back to another episode of Gravis House 4. We're of course playing with uh, Amber Night Fantasy mode as... Van Heide. <laughs> and we have started our colonization quite effectively. We are at least getting spread around here. We also have just uh, done the new Dawn Harbor with ignoring things a little bit. But now we need to go for seven places here, and I think that is happening. I mean, you're doing it yourself, but... We're getting some stuff for you done as well. We do need, need to definitely get this one done. I also found out that... Uh, we're not gonna get everything these guys have here, when we annex them. I've checked that, and we only get the provinces that they have. So, it's gonna be fairly ineffective. So if we want to do more, we just need to take everything instead. So we're gonna do that instead. For now, let's let the colonizing continue. After all, we don't have that much to do. And we're getting some more stuff done. So immigration is gonna take a moment. I've done this, right? Yep. Yeah. As the stated, our rights are gone. So we have some briefing room, and I guess we're gonna start digging up here. Lovely. Uh, you... I mean, to be honest, technically the opinion of my vassals doesn't matter that much. Except these ones for now, I guess. I'm now knowing that I probably want to actually focus a little bit more on admin. We're actually gonna do that. So, let's see... We still need to create... I mean, we need to really focus on no ruin, then. To get things done. I mean, 10, 20... Then it's 15. And this is where we jump over, right? Yeah. P paper... Oh, there's a center of trade as well. Okay, so we will create a center of trade there. It's gonna be on this coastline here somewhere. Yes, up to here. As mentioned from before, you guys have, I mean, technically tobacco here. Hmm. This one is grain. And there's no farmland here. I guess we're gonna have to accept that one then. Either way, Sawn Coast is giving us a little bit of an offer. They will buy the island when we... and give us assistance now. So basically when we jump over, they're gonna get this stuff here. And I think I'm gonna accept that. There's not a colonist here. And a bunch of other bonuses, so... yeah. So with that, we're gonna start building up you. Plenty of work to do, to be honest. I will see when we get you integrated then. I mean, I guess we're gonna do this as soon as we have the possibility. Uh, you continue the exploration. Uh, this force limit, I guess we're gonna make use of. Of course, we're gonna... Our force limit is gonna really, like, go up and down a bit. Because of our, uh... Oh, felt hat. Cool. Because of us basically creating these colonial nations, then we're gonna get rid of them again, and so on and so forth. Like, basically just a bunch of back and forth. Uh, I guess we can also get our navy now over. No, no need to have them over here, or anything. Diplomatic move, lovely. Three points is always good. I guess we can also switch some stuff around with the trade, because the dragon coast is no longer that important. I'm gonna actually put you here. And we're also gonna soon enough get another merchant. That guy's not gonna do something. Alright. Also, elves get uh, uh, 400. They they, uh, f they get 400 years old, so... I don't need to worry about this guy dying anytime soon, just from old age. Alright, we got that, and I guess we're gonna start... Oh, you have Yayak on your side. Who's Yayak? Yayek? 
Hmm. You guys have Inek on your side. And you have two. Do I know Yannick? Oh yeah, I'm just... Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, there's a reason I didn't see them. There's a very good reason I didn't see them. <laughs> okay, but we're gonna start building Spy Network around here. Oh, come on, don't tell me they succeed. Just because we just got interrupted by others. Alright. God damn it. A bit of a delay, but luckily enough it's not that bad. I mean, I kind of also want to get this colony finished here so that they are gonna start uh, colonizing upwards. I also assume that these guys are gonna uh, start showing up here soon. But I kind of want to leave them a little bit of territory so that they, are, they will create colonies there. Because if they create colonies there, we can just eat those up without any further issues. Hmm. Yeah, oh, this is, that's a decent explorer. But yeah, you just continue. See everything. We're probably also gonna get rid of exploration ideas later on. Because they're just not good if you don't colonize anymore. They're just not good then. Alright, get that merchant in. That also is gonna give us... Hope across the sea. The day of Ashen Skies was the lowest point in all of Elven Civilization, which makes the prospect of reversing the doom and reclaiming our home all the more appealing. Our people place their hopes and dreams in Alantir, and we must do our best to fulfill them. Yes, we do. Uh, also important. I don't care about you. Oh, but you're still, still gonna tell me about that. I see. Well then, do what you want, I don't care. So, we could also get a claim here now. Oh, that is a shit thing to get now. I wanted to integrate these guys. <laughs> like, this is the thing. Usually I would want to wait for them to have enough uh, uh, stuff available. Like, to actually get all of this stuff uh, uh, filled up. But at the same time... I want this place here. This is gonna be the, the capital. So I sort of don't care. To give them the rest. We, like the thing is we colonize so quickly. It doesn't matter really. It doesn't really matter. And nothing else matters. I mean, these guys are now at a point where they are gonna probably reach 7 soon enough. And then they're gonna, I'm gonna leave them alone. Because we technically don't need 10. Oh, we could also do something else here. Yeah. That's great. Doesn't that improve? That does improve. Lovely. Uh, you're gonna continue on here then. Screw it. Then we can annex you. Let's go. We're gonna get that annexation started, and we're gonna declare war on the guys over there. So, gonna take, yeah, a bunch of years because for some reason we just got a Diplo reputation uh, a punch. <laughs> well, we can't have everything, can we? Yeah, it technically would be Diplo reputation, but level 2, and I don't want to deal with that. So, do you want me to give you a court mage? Wait, what? Do you want me to annex them? Oh, oh, sure, you know what? Why not? That fits. Excuse me? Why do you guys always hate it? You're very aggressive. Oh, are you aggressive? No, you're not. Not at all, actually. <laughs> Good to know. 
Uh, other question. Mates. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> like... That's an odd place to be. Are you already preparing for this fight? Are you that eager? I can only uh, be happy about that, can't I? It's not right, Mr. Whale. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, sure. That happens, I guess. I mean, that's not gonna be a way uh, how we deal with the natives. So be it. Alright, you guys have still behind our technology. We can just do a conquest. And this one, I have no diplomat to send. Of course I don't. Oh, you are taking a decent bit of attrition. Okay, so you're gonna go home. And then when we are gonna deal with these guys, then we're gonna do things. So, this one, confirm, jump on them. That should be alright, right? I mean, technically so much stronger. <laughs> Just saying. I uh, need for resources. Okay, so instead of prestige, this costs actually... We're taking all of the, like a bunch of development just to get more global settlers. Okay, <laughs> sure. I'll take it. Okay, these, these guys are getting bullied. I mean, to be honest, they kind of outmaneuvered themselves here, didn't they? Like, this is just stupid. <laughs> Cristador is... Oh, but luckily enough, he's not uh, black flagged. Let's go, continue. So, I just want to help these guys out at this point, really. <laughs> you can go back here. They're still retreating. They retreated to this corner. Alright. Okay, you guys just protect your own territory. Makes sense. I'm actually doing surprisingly alright with the money. I thought we were gonna be a little bit more struggly, but seems like things turn out as they turn out. Yep, use your manpower to, de to do these fights. I don't want to use mine. Mine is far too valuable. Use those runeborn lives. What are you gonna do anyway? Okay, you've done that. So then we need to deal with these guys here. Oh. I mean, I guess we can do that, technically. Oh, but it, this is gonna... <laughs> no, we're not doing that. They're gonna walk here normally. And you guys are gonna make your way here. <laughs> Getting over boats is just gonna cost me more manpower, and I'm not here for that. Alright, you've done this. I guess we should probably start getting this stuff done. Because getting like these islands is always gonna be a little bit awkward. Oh look at that, we found them. Hello. I mean once again we should be crushing them. Yeah, we are. And then we killed some natives as well. <laughs> you know the usual stuff. Okay, I don't really care where you go, so... You guys go back home, because I don't want you to take too much attrition. I mean, I guess it's looking alright now. You can help out a little bit. Continue exploring. Uh, we're gonna get that, of course. Global settler increase. There's also one more colonist to gain. Here. Alright, you're done, and you're done. Well, fantastic. Here you go. And here you go. Actually, 
Am I gonna... No, wait, no, what? This We're gonna recall this guy. I'm gonna keep it at four. Because I don't know if we can still... Uh, <coughs> annex you if we don't ter own territory ourselves here. That I'm not too sure of. So I'm just gonna play it safe. No, oh, sure. To be honest, I think I have more than enough. Uh, we don't really care. I also need prestige because... <laughs> I think we're done with prestige for a while. I think with the elves, you usually do not have any pre prestige problems because they have. I mean, they have their own reduction, right? Elf administration, and sometimes they even have elven forebearers, which is just making it more ridiculous. So. Now. What I, of course, want to check here is I can take this province, right? I could take both provinces. Am I gonna get them then? Because this one is not, so let's quickly let me save. Yes, the save game is called Morally, right? Just to let you know. <laughs> okay, let's give this a go. I mean, of course, we're gonna take the money, because why not? Okay, we only get this province. So, what if I only take the tribal land instead? Is this just gonna give me the tribal land then? Because then I, w then I would clearly only take the tribal lands to get an instant colonization. <coughs> that just makes sense. Or do I just take it away from them? Well, we are here for these kind of experiments after all. Every time I do anything, anything with col uh, colonization, I need to retake these steps. Basically, just to re uh, to relearn how this works. So if we just do that and force you to give us your stuff here. I mean, we don't need prestige. Yes. Okay, then that's important. Of course, this is the wrong culture and everything, but we're gonna throw out Rainborn, so it doesn't matter. So you... I mean, we need to wait for you anyway. Uh, you're gonna run here instead. You guys can just sit somewhere. Uh, also, just to activate that. For now, I mean, this is the thing. I don't even know, know if I should purge the runeborn. That is a good question. Because I, I f like as I mentioned before, I know I think that the military guy is actually all right with the existence. I mean, I can change it later on to uh, nah. I'm I'm just gonna expose uh, them for now, just to make sure. Uh, obviously, we're gonna do that. Oop. Let's wait for little this dude to be back home. You guys unhappy? Oh right, I'm perching you. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I'm exposing, uh, exposing you. I get that. You know, I kind of get that why you're upset. Now, of course, one thing that we don't get is, like, we don't get a high development, right? Or do we? I mean, this is on 7. Oh, but it would have been across the board, so yeah, we don't get that. I highly assume. Uh, do I need to... Oh, yeah, no, technically... I mean, technically, I don't, but I'd want to get rid of the other extension, so... Let's do it. You guys, I'm not gonna take everything. I'm just gonna take your tribal land. Doesn't cost me really anything. Uh, this is just... Uh, this is gonna come back around. I mean, I guess I could do this, at least. So. Yoink. Thanks. Also, black flag, these guys. Lovely. That is gorgeous. Yeah, and we didn't get any extra development here. 
you guys are also heavily upset. So maybe... I mean, I guess I can come back around here. When things are upsetting. Actually, for a second I was like, do I not need to uh, uh, state this stuff? But yeah, I guess it gonna, it's coming around. You guys just do this stuff. Seemingly nobody wants to take this, so... Okay, but now we also have a connection to you, so it means we could technically get a uh, thingy started here. I claim. Spy network. This of course ta now takes also a little bit longer. Gold. Fish. The Quint Essentials. <laughs> Yeah, we're not gonna state the other stuff. That is just gonna be unpleasant. Oh wait, I don't need to do everything. Oh, I'm an idiot. One, two, three... Wait, what colonial regions are you in? Oh, this is all no ruin. Oh, then I need to do even less. Wait, do I even then call you at all? I mean, we have a slight Diplo reputation hit with this. I, as I mentioned before, I kind of want this one to get done first. Of course, we wasted a little bit of admin there, but I think I'm not doing this at all, then. You guys can do that for me. <coughs> I mean, this is one, this is one massive region, as a, yeah, of course. You guys are just doing that carefully. I mean, you... if you... Yeah, <laughs> I mean, financial security, I guess, is important. Oh, there we go. This has been picked, but... Next year. Oh, military has already been picked. Alright. Smarty fashion. Sure. So, a little bit of innovativeness. I completely forgot about you, and like I said before, you are not important to do this qu uh, to, to do this quickly. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on this one. I guess now that I'm, yeah, you know what, makes more sense if I have you over there when the rebels pop up. Minorities. Like, we're basically we're doing a slight push out of the Runeborn for now. If things go badly, we're gonna do it a little bit harsher. Or if things look differently, we're gonna do it a bit harsher. I guess I also want to get this forgotten question thingy done here. Trank and Explorer. I can live with that. Uh, what are we looking here? Alright, we can do that. Lovely. And we have the opportunity to keep our finances safe. Fish. Of course, the rune born a little bit upset. I can, under I can understand that, that you're not happy. Wait, so Dadan is just gonna sit here. With their black flag dudes. I... I'll take that. I'll take that any time of the day. Sure. <laughs> Do that, yeah. <laughs> Thanks of an elder. Let's get Edmund. Older daddy. <laughs> I guess we have to accept that. I mean, it's not too bad, to be honest. Like, we are very fast with this colonizing stuff now. So a little bit of uprising. That's alright. That's completely alright. Yeah, look at that. Like, what what really, ma uh, what really matters there? Barely anyone lives here anyway. As expected. <laughs> of course they're all the way over here. Uh, 
I guess we're gonna have to do it this Oh no, you hate me. Well, let's get everyone over here. Well, I guess I didn't expect you to do it that way, but... I guess it also works. I mean, at the moment, the manpower is not too problematic, so... Sure. Okay, you're done. Go right back here. Together, we have Doubt of the Rebels, and you come back here. <laughs> All right, like I said, we're gonna take the next claim here, take everything around you, and then throw you out. We can also take stuff from Enek. Enek has kind of pushed a little bit, but. Mm. Okay, you are gonna start getting more tribal land. Sure. You, you, you do you. Okay, this one is basically finished, so... Uh, I know what? Like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Okay, you already have ten. So that's alright. Oh, no, you don't have ten. Oh, this is not finished, that's why. Okay, I think I'm gonna do this one then. Like I said, I want to get, make these guys create the, uh, uh, the colony. So I'm not quite sure. If I should colonize more here. Either way, when I have this, when this one gets integrated or annexed, I have enough. I have more than enough. I have at least... I mean, all of this then turns into a colony, and they uh, have to core the stuff themselves. There we go. There we go. Let's actually just let these guys make a ten, uh, tenner colony here. Why not? Get some work on. Uh, this is done, yeah, still six years. Acceptable. Da, 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 da. Oh, we're great power. <laughs> All right, uh, sure, I'll take it. <laughs> Just snuck our way in here. Sure, I have to not take a look at the other stuff yet. If anything crazy is happening, so Jadadi failed. Okay, it looked so the end. Iliam seems to be the fairly dominant force here. Otherwise, I mean, Garvet is always doing their thing here. Becoming strong just to fail towards the end. A Gavidi special, they call it, <laughs> I think. I guess this one was a fairly good guy, so. Alright, let's take the next step. Need to do that anyway. More penalties, more penalties, and more penalties. Oh, right, we need to get a new claim here. Boop. Yeah, I think I'm gonna wait with uh, uh, getting... I mean, you're gonna stay there for now. I'm gonna wait until this annexing is done. And then I'm gonna do the conquest against the annex. I might as well also get another dude in. Uh, I probably should send like half of you guys up there. Let's just wait until you're finished and then I'm gonna half you. After all, there is guys here, right? Yeah. And they are not very happy about this whole situation. There we go. And this actually doesn't matter here because they don't have development anyway. You guys are gonna make your way over here. Sadly, we cannot have another leader yet, so I can't let you drill as well. So we'll have to suffer through that. All of that land drained.
Oh, that's fantastic, lovely. We are getting towards uh, uh, no money. And like I said, I would be, I'm very willing to click this button to stop that. Yeah, that should just do it. So. And I guess we would also end this episode here now anyway. So like always, like the Ram Shenanigans, and I guess see you guys next episode. Bye!